Yo, what's up? Bringing you that MLB Show 19. So, new set 15 headliner packs. The headliners first one is Richie Ashburn, 97 overall. Has 119 contact versus righties, 116 versus lefties, 58 power versus righties, and 57 versus lefties. 125 vision. Has gold tier defense, 88 speed. This card actually could be a problem. You know, the high contact, the high vision, very high speed. Overall, a really nice looking card. He's one of the headliners. The second one we have is 95 Roy Oswalt. 111 stamina, 83 hit per nine, 89 K per nine, 98 walk per nine, and 89 home run per nine. Got the 96 fastball, 94 sinker, 71 12 6 curve, 87 slider, and the 81 changeup. I think this card also will be really good. The other Diamond Oswald card was probably one of my favorite starting pitcher cards early on in the game. And this one's definitely better. The Hipper 9, I guess the Hipper 9 is a little low. You know, it would be nice if that was around 90 and above also, like the K per 9. But that 98 walk per 9 is going to be filthy. Being able to locate with this card, with that curveball and that high fastball, definitely going to be nice. So these packs are 5K. Is that cheap? Aren't they normally 7,500? So we're going to buy five of them. This is honestly like the worst thing that could happen because I'm not supposed to be spending my subs right now. I got to get the uh, the program bosses. So we got five of the set 15 headliners. Give me a diamond. <laughs> That's all I want is a diamond player. We get two silvers right there. I mean, whatever. Silvers are silvers. I was going to say something, but it's not even worth it. Ramos right there. So three more packs. Please let me see the diamonds. Two more silvers right there. We get Fletcher and El Mora. So nothing good at all. I just want to see a diamond game. We get a gold player. So Trey Turner. I actually like Trey Turner in this game. I think he's he's probably been like one of my favorite gold players. But we got to see that diamond. We got to see that diamond. It's not going to be a diamond, is it? Unbelievable. Another silver right there. Yuli Gurriel. I think he's been playing pretty good lately, though. So maybe he's an upgrade candidate. But he's only a 76. So, yeah, set 15. Another bust right there. Got, <laughs> got all silvers in Trey Turner. That's about it. So, I think that's the only thing that dropped today is those new set headliner packs with Oswald and Richie Ashburn. Let me see what they're going for right now in the market because those are definitely some players I would like to pick up and try out. So, Ashburn, what? I don't even know what position he played, actually. Uh, let's see right now. Let's see, Ashburn going for 28.35K. So that's kind of low right there. But I honestly think that's going to be a really nice card because that contact is really high along with that vision and speed. And cards like that normally do really good, especially this year. So Ashburn, I think he's, he's worth more than 28K. I think he's going to play like he's worth more than 28K, 100%. So that was the first one. And then Oswald was... A 95 overall. He's going for 69 to 79K right now. So that's not bad at all. You know, I think he's definitely going to be a, a solid starting pitcher. So definitely two cards I'm interested in trying out. And I think we're going to try going after him at some point. I did open up a 20-pack bundle earlier. So I'm going to just add it to this video. So we have a 20-pack bundle to open. Got him from the last events that were going on. So it wasn't a bad event overall. We were able to get Travis Hafner, Omar Vizquel. And now this 20-pack bundle. So we'll see if we can get anything good out of these packs. Let's start off with the regular packs and see if we can get some diamonds. Because we haven't pulled any diamonds in a minute. You know, from like actual packs, not guaranteed diamond packs. So it would be nice if we could get something. And maybe get some additional stubs. Because we, def <laughs> we definitely need some stubs. It's kind of hard making stubs now. Because we got diamond level 100. So you don't have that XP reward path to give you... Those additional stubs right there. So that kind of sucks. But, you know, we just got to open up some packs right here. And see if we can get anything good. So far, nothing though. Nothing good so far. Some bronze players. That's pretty much it. We did get that one silver, Jose Abreu. But that, <laughs> that was it so far. So, pack's not looking so hot. Pack is not looking so hot right now. Another bronze it is. So let me know how you guys did during the event. Oh, there's a gold player, Eddie Rosario. Let me know how you guys did, but let me know how you guys did during the event. If you got that Omar Vizquel, if you got that Hafner card, and if you guys opened up these packs too. You know, I think it was worth it just for the packs, 
even though it doesn't look like we're gonna get anything good out of these 20 packs but packs are packs you know they'll add up to some stubs we'll probably get like 5 10k out of it maybe 5k at the minimum because these are all bronze players and we're not even getting like gold players either so probably like 5k or so from these packs and we'll just take that we get santana right there not that crazy you know nothing crazy right now another bronze player at least it's a 74 we can use that for exchanges definitely can use that right there we're not even getting like diamond equipment or anything you know this is just a big old 20 pack bust another silver dyson Woo! all right three more packs to go can we get that diamond nope not in this one two more to go anything good another silver player we get devers does devers get upgraded can he get up to a goal? Possibly. Because he did get that player of the month. Diamond card. We'll flip this right here. Some batting gloves. And a silver player. Edwards Jr. <sighs> Man, what a what a 20 pack bundle. What a 20 pack bundle. 1 in 28 odds for a diamond. Probably not going to get it. I see. I didn't even mean to flip it like this. Damn. <laughs> I did not mean to do that, but we get McNeil. McNeil's not bad, I guess. He just got up to a gold card. So we'll take that McNeil card, and that is pretty much it. But that's going to do it for this one. So new set 15 headliners, Oswald and Ashburn. Like I said, I think they're both going to be solid cards. But let me know what you guys think about them. If you guys opened up any packs, let me know if you guys got anything good. Once again, we didn't get anything. Thank you guys for watching, and I'm out.